everybody, welcome back for another episode of What's Cooking Wednesday. I am cooking a brown sugar bourbon salmon and a cedar salad tonight for dinner. It's one of our favorites. We probably have this at least twice a month, maybe three times a month. I don't know. We love it. It's simple. It's easy. It's clean. Um, let's get to it. Alright guys, let's talk ingredients. Um, let's do the marinade first. So what we're going to need is you're going to need a half ounce of bourbon or whiskey. You're going to need a quarter cup of brown sugar, I prefer dark brown sugar, and one tablespoon of real maple syrup. You're going to mix all that up, kind of break up the brown sugar. You're going to pour that into a Ziploc bag with the two salmon fillets. Marinate that at least overnight. Sometimes two days is better, okay? So that way your salmon's ready to go. Okay, for the salad, it's real easy. You need a head or heart of romaine. Sometimes we use two, depending on how much salad we want. Um, I recommend Italian-style croutons. Your favorite Caesar dressing. I'm not making it from scratch. I have time for that today. This is our favorite, our go-to. It's called Lighthouse Caesar dressing and spread. It's in the cold section right next to the lettuce at Publix. And then also you can use the green bottle of shake uh, Parmesan like you would for a pizza, but for a salad, let's dress it up a little bit. Get the shaved Parmesan cheese. Okay, let's get that pan hot. Throw a little olive oil in there. I prefer a cast iron skillet because we're going to take it right from the stove top into the oven. If you... Alright, get that grease hot. When you see those little ripples going through it, you know it's ready. Lay your fillets in the pan away from you so you don't splash yourself. Sear those for one minute. Put a timer on. Okay, they've been searing for a minute. I'm going to take them, flip them over, nice and brown. Turn the heat off. Now that I got the heat off, I like to put a little bit of extra brown sugar on top. Good morning. There's no stab with the brown sugar. It's my business. Now the salmon's ready to go into the oven at 350 for 15 minutes. While the salmon's in the oven, let's make the salad. Tear up your lettuce. I always tell you, don't chop it with a knife, because when you chop it with a knife, the lettuce actually kind of has a reaction to the metal, and will start to brown and get a little weird on the edges, so tear your lettuce. Now we're going to add in some cheese, as much as you like, no one's judging. We like cheesy. Mix that up a little bit. Dressing on. Whoops. Don't break the bone. I'm getting stuff all over me. Excuse me. Alright. Let's give that a toss. Put as much dressing as you feel that you need. I like a wet salad, some people like dry salads, well, do you. All right, that's about the consistency of the dressing that we like. Throw a handful of croutons in. Couple of cracks of fresh pepper. Give that one last little toss. Salmon is done, let's get it out. Ooh, looks good. And what I like to do to finish this off is just put a little bit of butter in the pan. It's cold butter. And just Take that melted butter and put it right over it. Just baste it. You can even set one on there. I like it to melt. All right, now she's ready to plate. Perfect, every time. Let's eat. Okay guys, I hope you like this video and I hope you try this recipe. Uh, we are going to go eat this food because I am hungry. Until next time, remember to like, subscribe, and share, and I will see you on the next Wednesday. Bye-bye.